Hello everyone, uh, today I'm going to be ranking my top 10 surprising 2010 movies ranked. Um, if you're wondering what surprising is, uh, well, this is my, you know, like, thing for surprising. Surprising is basically a movie that, uh, like, you've seen or heard of, and you were not looking forward, uh, well, like, I was not looking forward to watching it, but when I watched it, it surprised me. Basically like that. But, yeah, further ado, let's get started with this review. Number 10 has to be The Town. I mean, number 10 is like, I knew it was going to be good, but I kind of had a little bit of a skeptical, a skeptical walking into this film, like a little bit of cautious walking into the film. The Town, it's in my top 10 favourite 2010 movies ranked. I like The Town. It's a fantastic movie. Uh, I enjoyed my experience with this film. I enjoyed it. My number nine has to be Tron Legacy. Tron Legacy was, it's a, it was really surprising for me. Um, I never knew that I was going to enjoy this film as what I watched, but I enjoyed it. It was a good movie. Um, yeah, it was good. It was enjoyable. I had fun with it. Yeah, I had fun with this film. Uh, it was a decent movie that I enjoyed. If you have not seen it, definitely check it out. Uh, Tron Legacy. It's a really, really entertaining movie that I had fun watching. Uh, can't actually, can't wait to actually watch it again because it's actually a really entertaining movie that I really did have fun watching. But Tron Legacy, it's a really enjoyable film. Number eight has to be The Karate Kid from 2010. Okay. I watched this movie w way back when I was a kid. Can't really remember anything about this film. But when I saw this film, I really was surprised. Because when I was a kid, I used to dislike this film. I did not really enjoy this film. But when I rewatched it, I actually grew a little bit of love for this film. Even though the original, uh, the original Karate Kid is one of my favourite movies of all time. The Karate Kid. 2010. It's still a decent movie that I do enjoy. Jaden Smith, uh, Will Smith's son, who plays uh, the new Karate Kid, he's great. Uh, I enjoy him in this role. He was great. Uh, Jackie Chan as a new uh, uh, leader, like helping him do uh, learn karate. Fantastic. I like the Karate Kid. Uh, yeah, I enjoyed it. Number seven has to be The Expendables. The Expendables is a decent movie. Um, I was surprised by this film. Uh, I watched it for my 31 31 action movies. Uh, I was surprised by that because uh, when I watched it with my 31 31 uh, action movies, which is still coming out, it's coming out in October 30, uh, sorry, not October, uh, what, monthly? August 30, uh, 31st. So with my animation. Anyway, The Expendables. It was, it was really surprising for me. Uh, I never knew that I was actually going to enjoy this film. Because uh, I had to watch it again uh, from my 31 31, uh, and then I had to watch it again from The Expendables as well uh, from, from my 2010. And I really enjoyed this film. The Expendables was an action packed, fun film that I enjoyed. If you haven't seen this movie, definitely check it out. It is a really decent film, uh, but yeah, I really enjoyed this film. Number six Hot Tub Time Machine. Okay. But I think this is a guilty pleasure for me. Hot Tub Time Machine was a really, really surprising movie for me. Uh, yeah, I was skeptical walking into this film. Like, I was very curious. I didn't know how I was going to react with this film. I was kind of thinking it was going to be bad. But then I found out it's actually a really surprising film. I I think it's a good movie. Uh, it's really funny. We've got Craig Robinson in this movie. Uh, I forgot who else, but... The standout for me was Craig Robinson. I think Craig Robinson was a great actor. And then we got that kid from Karate Kid. That guy from Karate Kid. Uh, not Karate Kid. Uh, Kick-Ass. He was great. But I really did enjoy uh, Hot Top Time Machine. It was an enjoyable movie. That I had fun watching. And definitely check it out. If uh, I was you. Definitely, definitely check it out. Because uh, it is a really surprising movie. Number five has to be Cash. Wow. Wow, this could have actually been my number one, but number five. Still a really, really surprising movie for me. Cash, 
I was thinking that this movie was going to be absolutely terrible, but when I watched it, jeez, I was surprised by how good this movie was. It's not in my top 10, I don't, top 10, 2010 movies ranked, but it was close to being there because it was really, really entertaining. I really liked Chris Hemsworth in this movie. Chris Hemsworth was really, really good in this movie. Uh, I enjoyed this film. It was fun to watch. I enjoyed it. Yeah, it's a decent movie that I had fun watching. Uh, Cash, I definitely recommend if you have not seen it. Uh, I liked the action. The story was good. The acting was decent, I have to say. But yeah, I really did enjoy this film. Number four, I was about to say number three. Number four is The King's Speech. Okay. I know I put on my top ten anticipated movies. Um, but... You have to have some skeptical walking into this film. I knew it was on my top 10 anticipated. I did watch the trailer before I saw it. Uh, and I think I should have done it before I did my top 10 anticipated um, with the trailer. When I watched the trailer, it kind of got me a bit iffy after this film. But when I actually watched the full length movie, it was really, really surprising. Uh, the King's Speech, it was a fun movie. Uh, I really did have a fun time watching the king's speech i definitely do recommend uh this film if you have not seen it it was a fun movie that i did have fun watching um the king's speech yeah it's a really entertaining movie and enjoyable number three has to be the fighter the fighter with christian bell and michael berg oh my god this film was such a good movie i was i really really did enjoy uh the fighter uh, it was really inti in entertaining. Uh, it was really enjoyable and a decent film. It's more than a decent film. It's a really great film. Um, it's I think it's in my top ten. I can't really remember. But it's a really entertaining, fun movie that I had a blast watching. My number two has to be Greenberg. Greenberg with Ben Stiller. Jeez, this film was absolutely fantastic. Might not have been in my top ten, but it'll probably be in my it would have been in my honourable mentions. I enjoyed Greenberg. It was a fun movie. Uh, it's a great movie as well. Uh, Greenberg was such a really, really, really entertaining movie. Uh, ben Stiller does a fantastic job in this movie, and I cannot wait to rewatch this movie. But my number one surprising movie from 2010 is Shutter Island. Shutter Island was so, so good. Uh, I loved Shutter Island. I give this movie like a 90%. It was fantastic. It was one of the, it's in my like top 10 I think. Yeah, it's in my top 10. Uh, I loved Shutter Island. It was a fantastic movie. Uh, Tom Hanks, no, not Tom Hanks, Leonardo DiCaprio, sorry. Did I always say Tom Hanks? I mean, Leonardo DiCaprio. God, am I, am I that dumb? Uh, Leonardo DiCaprio does a fantastic job uh, in this movie. I love this movie so much. Um, I seriously had a blast with Shutter Island, and I cannot wait to rewatch this movie. But yeah, that is my top 10 surprising movies from 2010. Uh, ranked hope you enjoyed it uh, please subscribe to my channel be a big help thank you for watching take care peace